Founded in 1995, the Women's Foundation for a Greater Memphis is a nonprofit organization of women helping women break the cycle of poverty through philanthropy, leadership, and collaboration. In 2015, the Women's Foundation for Greater Memphis announced its Vision 2020 strategic plan to reduce poverty by 5% over five years in zip code 38126, where 62% of adults and 76% of children live at or below the poverty line. The Women's Foundation for Greater Memphis has played a major role as a backbone organization, aligning people, resources, and coordinating community-based services through the two-generation approach, a method to strategically tackle intergenerational poverty. The Women's Foundation invests in programs that provide supportive services to individuals and their families. Yolanda Robinson is a graduate of the Getting Ahead in a Just Getting By World program facilitated by the Women's Foundation volunteers. The program taught Yolanda to build resources to create a more prosperous life for herself, her family, and her community. I'm participating in the Job Plus program, which uh, offered for the residents of Full Home, and I'm a member of the Women's Foundation now. This is a four-year program, and it's really to help you to save money, to better you, and to help out on your income. I learned it, that I was a product of generational poverty, and I learned that I don't have to keep passing it on to the next generation. It, it gave me a new adjustment on life attitude because sometimes your surroundings uh, have a lot to do with how it make you feel and not an open up by me meeting people that I see that want to help me. I want to help others and it's a chain reaction. I am transforming myself to be a self-motivator and much more positive person. To see a better change for myself and future generations. I can show them that there is a better way of thinking and living and, just, and don't settle for less. In getting ahead, I've gained knowledge as well as new friends, family, and role models who can relate to my circumstance, for instance, the Women's Foundation. What the Women's Foundation learns through Vision 2020 will build a framework to combat poverty throughout the city and the nation for many years. It will empower low-income women to become economically self-sufficient and be strong role models for their children. Lisa Conrad took what she learned as a participant in the Institute for Women's Empowerment program led by the Lynx Incorporated Shelby County, Tennessee, and through her own personal growth, passed it along to her family, proving that when you help a woman, you help her family and change a community. And going through the Women uh, Empowerment Institute, it became a good source uh, for me because I was going through a lot. I was carrying a lot of um, heavy burdens on my heart. And um, that program really helped me a lot to just put a lot behind me and first of all to accept myself for who I was. Uh, to regardless of what I was going through, you know, through it all. Um, and so it, it, it became a big inspiration in my life. I first uh, became involved with the Women's Foundation of Greater Memphis through Urban Strategies Memphis Hope. So I've been around for a long time and I became an ambassador, went through the class to become an ambassador for the Women's Foundation of Greater Memphis. I've carried my duties out uh, to the best of my knowledge and has been successful so far, thus far. The five goals of Vision 2020 are to help families in 38126 meet their basic needs, equip residents with marketable job skills to gain living wage employment, prepare all children zero to five for kindergarten, develop positive outcomes in youth, and help families gain the financial education skills to reduce poverty. 
In 2016, the Women's Foundation announced a $1 million investment to 22 grantee partners with programs focused on supporting the Vision 2020 goals. The Women's Foundation for Greater Memphis grantee partner, Girls Experiencing Engineering, is a summer program that seeks to instill young women with awareness of career opportunities within STEM fields. Programs like G provide development opportunities for young leaders like sisters Anne and Anna Rahim. Inspired by what they learned, they volunteered as mentors at G during the summer and both are now engineering majors at Harvard. And both years, I saw the positive uh, impact that this program had, especially with introducing girls to engineering and girls who would have never had the chance to know, that they, they, to know that they could succeed in STEM. So I think one of the greatest positive changes that happened as a result of my uh, participation in this program was the realization that uh, giving girls the opportunity to really explore fields that usually aren't necessarily girl dominated, they're usually male dominated, giving them the opportunity to explore these fields and realize that they're actually really good at them and that they can succeed in them if they want to was very empowering for me. I think what the G program does is it gives girls the chance to experience engineering from a young age. And if uh, a student learns about engineering from a younger age, they're more likely to pursue it because they know that it's achievable. Is that even if you don't decide to do engineering, it gives you the confidence, it gives girls the confidence to pursue whatever they want to and to realize that locked doors aren't actually locked and that they can actually do whatever they would like to in their futures, and that's really powerful. Thank you very much to the Women's Foundation of Greater Memphis. Your work is invaluable, so thank you very much. Thank you, WFGM! Because of your support, the Women's Foundation is able to continue moving the vision forward. Through the power of philanthropy, leadership, and collaboration, the Women's Foundation for a Greater Memphis's impact is widespread, producing outcomes that change lives.